Hello guys and girls, Voices from the Dark here. What are we doing in the main screen of Oblivion? I don't know, I just wasn't patient enough to actually wait. So, how are you doing? It is a beautiful day. Uh, it's a beautiful day here in Beville. Everybody is happy, everybody's doing front flips. And in the last episode we did a lot of uh, thievery missions. But I kinda want to do more. <laughs> I know it sounds like incredibly greedy and stuff, but I want us to get to like, um, I want us to get, I want us to finish the thief skill, basically. That's what I want to achieve, because once we finish the thief skill, we can do some serious stuff. It's just gonna generally help us in all other aspects of the game. So I think we could prioritize here. All right, so we were told to ask in the Imperial City for a courier. Of course, we will wait, because it's always interesting if the Grey Fox himself wanted to wanted to talk to us. And now, usually we could have just listened to his voice to figure out who he was, but considering there's like five voice actors in the game, that's not really gonna work. All right, I have a message for you from the Grey Fox. Meth? What is the message? The Grey Fox has a task for you. Meet him at Helvius Cecia's house in Bruma. Okay. That sounds interesting. And that is what we shall do. Turning a blind eye. Going to the Bruma East Gate. It's time to talk to the Grey Fox to get some assignments from him himself, which means they're gonna be more tricky, but have more cash rewards. I don't have time. But seriously, there will come a time where we will no longer have to fear getting put in jail. I swear it. I swear it. Right. What? The Grey Fox is waiting for you. Oh. He's inside, downstairs. Don't keep him waiting. Am I a bad person for thinking this was supposed to be a chick? Helvius? I don't know, I just thought it was a girl name. But, but, we can't keep the Grey Fox waiting. <gasps> this is so exciting! We're gonna meet him in person! And there he is. Come. We must talk. The Grey Fox. I see you got my message. It's an honor to finally meet you. I have need of your special gifts. There is an item hidden away in a remote monastery. Ooh. I need you to go get it for me. The monastery is extensive and well guarded, so you should make sure to be well prepared. Should you succeed, I will pay you well for your services. I would be honored to help. Capital. The monastery is called the Temple of the Ancestor Moths. It is where retired, blind moth priests go to wait out the rest of their days. I will mark the location on your map. Look for it in the far northeast of Cyrodiil, beyond Chaden Hall. I need you to acquire Sevilla's Stone. It is a large crystal with special properties that I need to gain advantage. Remember, do not shed innocent blood. However, there is no blood price for slaying the stone's guardians, human or inhuman. All right. When I receive word that Sevilla's stone is missing, I will be here waiting for you. All right. Shadow hide. So the moth priests, if you were not aware, are people that have like um that have read Elder Scrolls. I'm not really sure like of the exact details, but when you play like the um the Skyrim DLC called Temple of the Ancestor Moths called the Dawn Guards. Where should we go from? Let's go from Frostcrag Spire. You uh, will have to en uh, encounter a uh, moth priest, and you will also read scrolls yourself. So, fighting against blind people, I think we're gonna be okay. If you don't have this place on your map, it's like part of the download downloadable content. Uh, I have a lot of those packs. I'm not really sure what version of Oblivion I have. I just... Oh boy, that looked horrible. Render in now. I just know that I got a PC version of Oblivion. <laughs> so, some people have been asking if I'm gonna do like the DLCs like Shivering Isles and Knights of the Nine. I'm not sure, really. We'll just have to see how long I'm gonna extend the Oblivion adventure. This is mostly just a nostalgia trip. And I see that people are enjoying it as well, so that's why I'm uploading it on the main channel instead of my second channel. 
if you didn't know, I have a second channel called VF3 Nostalgia where I play mostly nostalgia games and other games I don't feel like fit on the main channel, so if you want to find something extra, you might want to look there, but uh, self-promotion over. Let's see if we can't find this place. Now, sneaking through blind people, that's not gonna face or be much of a challenge, but I cannot go- You cannot go that way! Come on. Alright, let's try and kind of go past the uh, invisible border here. We should be able to, I mean, come on. We're right by Skyrim now. <laughs> let's ride into Skyrim, everybody! Yay! We suddenly find people with good graphics. It's like, what? The Gerald Mountains. I think I picked like the most deserted place ever to ride. But yeah. Like they did a major graphical improvement from Morrowind to Oblivion. They did a major improvement from Oblivion to Skyrim. So I'm just wondering how the Elder Scrolls 6 is going to look. Man, next generation Elder Scrolls. Oh, gives me sh uh, shivers. Here we go. Getting closer. You're a good girl, Shadowmere. Is Shadowmere a boy or a girl in this game? I think it's a girl in this game, but I think somebody told me that it's a boy in the next game. I'm not sure what happened, but Shadowmere has some dirty secrets. Okay, wait here. I'll be back. Eh. I'm stuck, Shadowmere. Shadowmere! Oh boy, I don't want to be stuck. No! Just ride up. Down. Here the temple is. I don't know if there's gonna be anybody outside, but we best not take any chances. If we're gonna be doing sneaking, on with our gear. Okay. What do we have here? Found the temple. Now just to locate Civil Stone. Maybe I can persuade one of the monks to help me. Oh, let's talk to him. Hello, stranger. Oh, you can see. Oh, you're not one of the priests. What can this peaceful monk do for you, stranger? Uh, Civilis Stone. I have no idea what you're talking about. Guess we gotta pursue. Really? Thought I could say what you're going to say. All right, let's see. I can't. You I like could... coercing get and admi from me. admiring? Please get up. I can't argue with that. All right, so up I and down, can't. the easiest ones to do. I not. What a wonderful this is like the bribing minigame in really? Oblivion if you haven't seen it before. Not funny. It is Not insanely gotta stupid. <laughs> gotta get like the uh, wedges good. on the right places. That's enough. Come on. Get up, Slowly I'm we're gonna in increase it. Your goodness. What? I don't know if he is That's actually going to talk about the stone. We'll what have to I see. Your I hope please. he is. I doubt it. You win. Right. Come on, we're best buddies no, by you. now. I doubt it. You don't doubt Not it. Real. I I can't argue with 79. that. 79. No. All right, this is gonna be the final one. Get 85. Not bad. I have. Okay, he doesn't know. Blind We serve the retired moth priests from the Imperial City. The work they do leads to progressive blindness. They live in utter darkness in the secret catacombs. Of course, it doesn't affect them because they're blind. Okay. It's our natural barriers that keep us safe, mostly. Mountain borders north and east, open sea to the west, and bogs and rainforests to the south. Oh, you're talking about Cyrodiil in general. Okay. May you always wear soft silks. Wasn't this guy supposed to, like, help me? Gosh darn it. Thief, <gasps> you won't get away with this. Okay, so now he probably sent like a uh, freaking telegram, to, like psychic telegram to all the guards in the realm. Alright, he caught me. Let's sneak in here and have a look. Oh, I'm actually allowed to break in, that's refreshing. I guess there has to be another monk who knows the answer we are looking for. I should have known he didn't have more info about the stone. If he knows more about a topic, it's gonna remain golden instead of turning grey. But I wanted to give it a shot. And yeah, yeah. Gotta love the lock picking game in Oblivion. 
Whew. Hello. What can this? Uh, stone. Who is this? Uh, Sevilla, a uh, former lover, perhaps. This guy knows. So now I gotta do we'll it with see. you. <laughs> don't. Jokes and I coercing. Don't waste your flattery. Boom, Shoot. boom, don't. boom. What? I doubt it. Boom, I, boom, not boom. Yeah. Not now. Not. Ba -da -ba -da -bum -bum -bum. Not now. I doubt it. This is such a boring what? mini game. I, <laughs> whatever. Right. All right. I, I really shouldn't be telling you this, but I know you are trustworthy. Totally. The blind monks in the catacombs guard the stone. It's said to have magical powers. Don't tell Heridi I said anything. I could be banished for telling you. Alright, so he disguised the correct one to talk to. Where are the catacombs? I can't reveal that. It would be far too dangerous. I don't know you that well. You serious? Take your 72. time. 72. Uh, yeah, don't waste uh, your flattery. I don't... I <laughs> 78? <laughs> nope, not now. I doubt We have to be best buddies by not, now. Not not now. That works for me. Okay, okay, I'll show you. But only because you are my dear friend. What the fuck? Follow me. What? Please be discreet and don't bother the other monks. Bethesda, did you try your own game? Because there's a serious F up right here. The people of Nibony consider themselves. I don't care about them. May you always wear soft silks. You too, buddy. He just got that creep voice straight out of nowhere. Ugh. All right. I totally don't look suspicious or anything. Dun, dun, dun. The crypt. The awesome crypt. Okay. I got seen or heard. I hope you have found your stay here pleasant. Yes, from the catacombs. Of course, this is pleasant. I've entered the catacombs of the blind monks. Hinted that the true guardians of Civil Stone will not be subject to blood price. I'm betting that also means they won't be too happy to see me. I better be careful. Okay, so we can actually kill. It's nice to know if things go south. Let's try and be stealthy here. I can actually use my spells. What's that? Nothing. I can steal your key. Let's see. Nobody. All right, can I equip myself a torch? Let's see. Okay. Sneaking with the torch. That's how I do. Sneaking with the torch. Yes, it's true. Sneaking with the torch. I'm so blue. Sneaking with the torch. Do do do. All right. Old wooden door. What's behind here? Nothingness. Ooh, goodies. There's probably several paths through here. More the breeding. If I'm ever in trouble under the ocean for some reason, it would be nice to have that. But you rarely go underwater in any test game. Correct me if I'm wrong. Or maybe Morrowind, I don't know. But at least not, as I've noticed, in Oblivion. I mean, we do have that one guild quest where you have to like go down into the well, but that's just such a short swim. Never mind me. Who's there? Your mother. Good. I feel kind of bad for them. <laughs> What's that? Must be so freaking scary to be blind. All you see is darkness. I think I don't know. Scary still. Okay. Lockity lock, lockity hip hop, hoppity hoppity lock, bark bark. Get all the tumblers up. I actually didn't start a timer. Damn, okay, let's just do two Thieves Guild missions this episode and let's say that's, uh, that's good. Rats. 
Who are you gonna call? How on earth could you know? Screw you. Psst. Stupid, stupid. Okay. The temple of something something, but it sounds rather sinister. Which is good. I like the sinister places in our world. They remind me of home. Let's go in here. You're sleeping. How can you like unlock the door anyway? You're blind. Gold. And that door looks rather um, sturdy. Oh, it's locked. What am I gonna do? Oh boy. Where are we going now? Okay, so I wonder how this stone is going to look. It's going to be big, if it's going to be small. That's what Sandra Ney said. And now we're going to carry it. And what's going to guard it? I mean, down here, we might meet other stuff than simply blind priests. So let's keep our eyes open. Let's grab some gold. Dun dun. Oh. Skeleton. Eh. Down. Good. A potion of healing, potion of sorcery. Good types of potion. Alright, who's next? That spikes all over the place. Okay, let's do this. Uh. Ow. Okay. Pro uh. Ow! Okay. Probably a trap in the roof there. Ghost. Ghostbusters! Gonna kill your ghosts with the dwarven sword. Shrine of the Moth. This sounds like we're getting closer. Doing the Thieves Guild will give you access to fences. Just always good, because I still don't understand how the shopkeepers can understand what's stolen and what's not stolen. Like, maybe people say, oh, this item is stolen, don't buy it from anybody, but it's still... Oh boy. I don't like those crystals. Oh, wait, that that's the stone. Anybody else here? That thing is glowing. <laughs> the stone is firing and I'm just hiding behind him. He's taking the damage. Alright, gimme, 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 gimme. Gimme the stone. <gasps> That's the stone. Not to get it back. Okay. I'll take your katana and your ring of intelligence. Let's go. I'm gonna just check it. 10 damage. Oh, Daikatana, it's like a two-hander. Ah, still pretty cool. We'll try it out. And we got it. Let's head on back. And uh, let's just slay any we anybody we meet on the way. We've been stealthy the entire time. Let's find ourselves a cool spell we wanna use. Always enjoyed finger of the it uses a lot of magicka though. What do we want? Let's use a hell ride for a second. We actually get to somewhere interesting. Am I going in the right direction? <sighs> treasure. Yay, treasure. I am so bad at like navigating in caves. Alright, this is where I came from. Good. We're gonna just wreck, wreak havoc. I don't know. We're just gonna do stuff. We're gonna, we're gonna kill them all. Oh, the dangerous traps. Ooh, spooky. The traps in Elder Scrolls games, at least Oblivion and Skyrim, haven't really been that effective. I mean, they don't really do a lot of damage to you.
All right, Hellride has been activated. Let's go and kiss one of these guys. Lover's kiss. Whew. All right, let's summon our skeleton guardian. And now it's time. Finger of the mountain. Now die! Ha ha ha. Boom. Bring it on, you old hag. Gotcha. You got a katana too, buddy. Nice one. Sadly, it wasn't enough. Good work, skeleton. And I had that skeleton for 60 seconds. That's actually pretty decent. Alright. Let's go, skelly. Maybe more people need a beating. Attack! You think you're so cool? I don't think so. Whoa, where are you going? Come back here. Don't you run from me. Oops, hit my own skeleton. <gasps> that didn't happen. Oh well. He wasn't too good anyway, so. And a storage room. Never understood the dispel potions, really. Okay, let's find a way out of here now. Oh my god, did you see that jump I did with the katana? Like, whoa! Oh, that is so cool! Like, I'm gonna freaking jump and slash them in two. Oh my god, that is nice. Right, I gotta play around some more with this. Maybe I can enchant it. Let's do that. Let's go to the arcane university and let's enchant this katana and name it something. I'm sick of just using the weapons we find. This is a weapon with personality and... As so, it deserves a name. Yeah, uh! We shall call it... The Priest Slayer. The Priest Killer. The... The... Uh, Moth Smasher? I don't know. We'll, we'll figure out a cool name for the sword. Dun dun dun. Thanks. I hope you have found your stay here pleasant. Totally. Thanks for all your help. Uh, you wouldn't want to go down there for like... Ever? Okay? Good. Alright, quest complete. Let's return and tell the Grey Fox how successful we were in our mission. And maybe he'll be proud of me. Hey, the guards aren't mad at me. Stage your bit. Good. Uh, Reynold Rallis. Yes. The vampire hunter. As far as I know, he just showed up recently here in Bruma. Not only that, but he already found a vampire among us. Oh. Apparently, Brayden Lyrian was one of those vile creatures, and Rainil slew him. Kind of strange, though. I never figured Brayden to be a vampire. Maybe he wasn't. He seemed to be such a likable fellow. A brotherhood Stop betrayed. That. Enough. Interesting, I'll, I'll keep it in mind. We have a lot of quests to do. Oblivion is a game you can just play for like 200 parts and still not finish. But it's not like The Witcher. I recently tried The Witcher and I know that it has like a very long storyline, but it's dragging on. I'm on chapter... I enjoyed chapter 1 of The Witcher 1 so much. It was so much fun. But I got to chapter 2 and everything just... Talk to this guy, talk to this guy, go and collect these stones without markers on the map. Now go collect these plants for this girl who can owe you a favor. It's horribly boring, I'm gonna be honest. So I hope the game's gonna catch up, but other than that, The Witcher seems pretty cool. I know The Witcher 3 is coming out, so if I do complete The Witcher 1 and 2, maybe we'll play that. We'll have to see. Fox. I hear the monks were most hospitable. Sevilla Stone. My sources tell me that Sevilla Stone has gone missing. Do you have it with you? Of course, dude. Capital! Now I can see past the palace defenses. Oh, it's a good thing the Emperor didn't know they had this stone. He would have had it destroyed or taken it from them and kept it under lock and key in the palace. When I have learned what I need to know, I will call for you again. Let us leave Helvius's house now. He has served me well and deserves his peace. Yeah, he does. Shadow Hydra. Okay, so the Grey Fox is going to use this to 
spy on the white gold um, tower. Need to steal more. I probably have stolen over 700, I think. Yep. Yeah. So now let's go to the Imperial City and let's hear what uh, what he has to say. We're slowly getting closer to the final quest, guys. Slowly getting closer. And it's gonna be one heck of a ride. It's snow, it's snow. Da -da 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 -da. Okay. Let's wait here and see if Meth can find us. It's a Saturday at 12 a.m. She'll be able to find us pretty well. It is the year 433. It's a nice year. I gotta just sneeze. Alright, Meth, what you want? It's good to see you. Am you say? I have a message for you from the Grey Fox. What's the message? The Grey Fox has a task for you. Meet him at Melintus Ancus' house in Coral. All right, you joined the Thieves Guild? Yes, I did. After you saved me in Castle Skingrad, I vowed to join. I was having no luck on my own. Now I am running errands for the Grey Fox himself. I owe you much for your help. What's going on with the weather? Seriously, look at this. May shadow hide you. Clear skies. Beautiful clear skies. Okay, maybe it stopped. But you saw what I saw. And it was strange. Let's equip some other gear. Boom, 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 boom. Up with this. Excellent. Alright, let's take our katana to the uh, Arcane University. And let's see if we can't do a little fixing on it. Uh, we're gonna need a Grand Soul Gem. Do we have a Grand Soul Gem? I would think we would. Oh, we got six of them. I know we need them later for a quest. That's like... Uh, I can't remember what kind of quest that is, but... Oh well, I think it's like trying to reverse something quest, so it's not really needed, I guess. The Praxographical Center. I can't remember which room is the correct one. We'll just have to look around a little bit until we find it. And it's the oh, correct man. one. If I had a question how about are you armor, today? I'd probably ask oh. Barnado at the best offense. Oh god, he knows a lot about it. Altar of spellmaking. Okay, the this is the spellmaker place, but I think I got like the um Yes, we can make our own spells. Should we? Let's actually make our own spell, why not? While we're here. This is something I should have played around with earlier. Okay, so what do we want? Basically, we can make spells that... Uh, uh, the more we add to the spell, the more uh, magicka they're going to cost. And they're going to be like higher level, like Apprentice, Adept... Uh, or is it called Journeyman in this game? Expert and Master? It's gonna cost money. Let's first check, how much magicka do we have? 130. That's not very much. Okay, so 130. Let's take a... We don't know a lot of things. A fire spell. And uh, it's touch or target spell. This is gonna be a... <laughs> you can actually damage yourself with spells, which is kind of cool. Let's make a touch spell, shall we? Touch. And it's gonna be a huge area. Okay, it's going to be a touch spell, and when we touch them, they're going to burn for 5 seconds for 10 damage in an area of... Actually, let's not have an area. Let's just have an area of 10. How does that look? Does that look like a nice little spell? We'll only be able to cast it once, though. 53, we'll be able to cast it at least twice. But actually, let's see, how far can we push this? 15... Destruction skill of 75? Ah, bollocks. Destruction skill of 50. We have that, right? I think so. Uh, this spell is going to be... Um, we're gonna name it... Heartburn. 
How are you? Yay, please tell me I have enough in the skill. 54. I'm a journeyman. Here is the heartburn skill. Or the heartburn spell. What I like about spells in this game is that you don't have to equip them in your hands. You can just do it like that. Mystic archives. Let's just look inside. I think this is just going to be like a library place. And I was correct. Now there's a place where we can enchant our goodie. This weapon looks pretty, like, used. Like, it's been... It's been in a few situations. That's okay. Should have figured it wasn't there. What do you want? Hello, magician. None of these people have anything interesting to say. Practice rooms. Doesn't sound like it. Hi. Chironasium. That sounds more like it. Um, Ultra of Enchanting. Let's add our... Should we do like the, the Elven... I want a badass katana. Simple as that. What do we want with it? Shock damage is always cool. Light? Could I make it light up? That's so cool. Alright, what if we do shock damage? In a huge area. Area of a hundred. But I don't know how good that is if that's gonna like damage everybody in the area. <laughs> but let's make it pretty big. Let's make it an area of 40 yards and it's gonna be like as powerful as can be. Okay, so shock damage nine points in 40 feet. So this one, when you strike somebody, it's just gonna go bzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzz
Okay. Shadow hike. Gotta collect the arrow of extrication. So I guess this is the third final quest. So let's go down to Breville, get some information and see if we can acquire ourselves that arrow. First we're gonna talk to some beggars. Hey. I'm sorry to impose upon you like this, but I'm in need of assistance. Oh, you're not a beggar. I don't know what to do. My husband, Alaron, is missing. Oh. Alaron? It all started when Alaron became foolish and started gambling. He'd visit the arena every week and spend our hard-earned money on bets. I told him to stop, but he didn't listen. He was certain he could win us a fortune and move us somewhere nicer, like the Imperial City. He didn't take long for Alaron to begin losing. He resorted to borrowing money from a usurer to cover his losses and place new bets. As you can imagine, it didn't pay off. He ended up owing around 500 gold. We could never have that kind of money to pay back the usurer. What happened? Yesterday, the usurer, Curden Grow Dragel, sent for my husband to meet him at the Lonely Suitor Lodge. He hasn't returned since. I fear for his life. Curden isn't known for his patience. Please, I'm not wealthy. But I'd give anything to see Alaron again. All right, I'll save that jerk. You... you will? Oh, thank you. Okay. Farewell and be careful. Curtin is not to be trusted. I won't trust him. Hello. Bosmer. Just thought I'd say hello to you on this nice evening. Praying to that weird statue. Interesting. All right. Increase in my athletics. Don't you hiss at me, boy. Damn it. Let's go find a beggar. I don't know if there are going to be complications with stealing this arrow. I guess it is. If the quest is going to have some length. Hey. I'm only asking. I don't care. Feathers. What are friends for? <laughs> Feathers. He's also the wizard in the tower outside of town. He keeps his most treasured items there, not in the castle. Only Fathis can open the door to the tower, but there is supposed to be a secret passage somewhere in the castle that takes him to his tower. All right, it's the castle one. Okay, thank you. Blessings of Akatosh upon me. So we got to get into the castle once again, and we got to find the secret passage that will take us to his giant crap-filled tower of dangerous stuff. I hope this is not gonna go over one hour. If you see any weird cuts in the videos, that's the reason. We can't go over, because that would ruin it for my mobile viewers. Ba -dum -ba -dum. YOLO. Alright, if we're gonna go in there and sneak, we're gonna need our gear on. Oh yeah. Yes. Don't make me use the sapper on ya. Like, it's gonna be best for crowded rooms. It doesn't really do, like, a lot of damage. But it's still pretty awesome. Still pretty awesome. The range is what's gonna do it. Make it awesome. I have no idea if it's gonna be awesome, but... Okay. What? Leave me alone. Leave okay. Me alone. Can you guys go away? They're both staring at me. Why do you bother me? Go away. Because you're pretty. Okay. Here we go then. Let's do a little sneaking in the castle. Go. I could actually use a key to this castle. That would make this a lot. Stop it. Where's my. Let me get a key first. Okay. Key, 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 key. I'll, I'll get a key later on. I'll find it from a garden here. YOLO. One. Dos. That's how we count in English. Ba -da -ba. Okay. Let's see what we can find. Okay. 
Okay, so... This is obviously the wrong place. Let me take a look at the map before we're busted in here. Oh, we're, it's not actually in the Great Hall. Okay. Why do you bother me? Oh, but I thought I could get to the Lord's Manor that way. I should be able to, right? I need to. This is impossible to get in that door. Okay. Uh, stupid cards. Okay, let's just try going in here then. I'm not really sure how we're gonna get in there. Maybe we'll just run in and... I don't know. If all else fails, we'll just do a YOLO run. Come on. Be kind. Gentleman of Light Armor will have it to grade 50% slower. The bonuses of being... He didn't care. This is sweet. Okay. Barracks. Uh, let's try this. I would love a key though. Although the minigame is fun and all, sometimes you would just want to get in. And come on. There. And there. This leads nowhere. This is a stupid place. You guys don't care, do you? Go take your break. Another day, another septum. That didn't happen. Stop right there! Come on! That's too. Okay. Probably didn't have any stolen goods. Okay, I've had it. Yolo. Okay, I'm not gonna hit him. Go away. You go away. I'm gonna go in here. Come on. Then there. Stop. I don't care. I'm going in. Okay, let's just run to the tower and see if there's gonna be any monsters that can kill the guards for me. Run. Go go go. Uh, auto attempt. Yes. Found the room. Lock the door. They're not gonna follow me? Right. What's this? <gasps> Jewelry box. Okay. I need to nail this one. I want his jewelries all over my face. Let's see. Good. We can actually get the skeleton key in this game as well, so that's something to uh, consider. Right now, we're doing okay, I think. I didn't find it. I should explore the secret passage. Yep, I wasn't actually expecting to find it there, so no worries. One, two, three. Increasing skill and blade blunt hand to hand, new power attacks. Oh, yeah. Somebody down there. Is that a Jumora? <clears throat> oh yeah, it is. What the heck is a Jumora doing here? Does that do 10 damage? And it's like a normal blade? Damn it, I'm gonna take it. Damn it, I can't pick up anything I want to. Okay, so we got... Well, it looks... This is a blade. Oh wow, that was it. Now I think actually I'm gonna maybe. Oh, but it's heavy. Yeah, it's way too heavy. Have enough room? Of course I. Okay. Didn't expect it to be that heavy. Let's 
put it with this. Ah, oh, we can sell it. Does everything have to be locked down here? I mean, come on, YOLO. There we go. Auto attempt is actually surprisingly useful. Except for in Fallout, because then you kind of destroy the lock and can't pickpocket your way back in. Mud crab. You think I'm scared of mud crabs? Come on. Come on. I'll, I punch your mud crabs. That's how much I care. Wait, who are. Oh, slaughterfish. I really don't like slaughterfish. I'll, I'll just punch them to death. There's actually a skill in this game called hand to hand. So I remember I made a character. How do you know I'm here? I made a character that was like all um, hand to hand. Oh, good times, good times. Seriously, is this just gonna be a crap room where I can't get anywhere? Oh, chest was on gold. Thank you, thank you. Just what I wanted. Let's find the correct way. I think the Demora is fighting somebody. I don't know who. Ooh! What's down here? Oh boy. I'm gonna run out of breath soon. Yeah, this is bad. Uh, I, ha I found a potion earlier, didn't I? Told you it would become handy. Strong potion of the sea. <clears throat> Go away, slaughterfish. Go through here. And... The heartlands. I guess this passage is gonna... Is, does he seriously have to go through all of this every time? Or did I just take like a completely different route? Huh. Okay, let's just go upwards. Oh. There's a surface of water. Oh, man. Well. <laughs> I don't think this is the right place, guys. I don't think so. Alright. Let's go back down again. Do I have like a light spell? I can use, cause it's dark down here. Is that gonna help? A little bit. Chest with goodies. Now where's the door? Where is that gosh darn door? No, I can't lose it! Where? This rock. Gotta be quick now so I don't have to drink another potion. Oh, it was a trap door! Okay. Okay, let's go. Ugly slaughter fish. Do not approve. And... Gonna be a close one. Freedom! Good. Now, where am I actually supposed to go? Gosh darn it. Can I not walk into the water here? Let's try another path. I'm back here again! Alright, I think I found the passage. Damn, that was well hidden. Alright. Who wants a piece of me? Yeah. Silly Dramora. Thinking you got swag and all. When you don't. You really don't. Need to find a key to this door. I got a spell selected, I don't even know what it is. Flame touch. Let's do Finger of the Mountain. Always oh, a classic. Da, da. Hey! Nanorut. Nanorat. Alright, who has the key here? Could I please have it? Wizard Slayer. Guess we're going this way. Auto attempt. 
Okay, that doesn't work. Probably a waste, but we still get experience, so... Besides, we're in the Thieves' Guild. Lockpicks is not really something that we're gonna have trouble getting. Okay. Da -da. Another wooden door. Another lock. Everything has to be locked in this place. He's very careful about that. Oh. Hey there, conjurer. Flame Atronach. Marthar's a fan of those. And you're dead. What do we have in here? What are you trying at? That's what I thought. Ain't nobody gonna live on my watch. Let's equip another real weapon. Ruins Racer, it's been a while. We're gonna stab you. La 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 la. Somebody knows I'm here. It's pleasant. Place no more locks. There's somebody behind me. Ha ha. You gave yourself away when I heard a giant shoom shoom from your freaking. What did you use? And she conjured like a warhammer or something. Not the most stealthy weapon. Okay. Sick. Hi there, Flamey. How you doing? Bye bye. Why won't you die? Because I don't want to die. And they have a lot of potions here, that's good at least. Very excellent. Alright, so I'm not really stealthing here, I realize that. Another gate, Bethesda, come on. At least give me like a key somewhere. <laughs> I don't have to do this all the time. Alright. What's up, noob? Oh, you're spawning in a lot, aren't you? Get back up here. <gasps> Ooh, adepts, are you? Alright, we'll see about that. We'll see just how adept you are. Come at me, bro. No, you don't. No, you don't. Oh, he's even healing this guy. Nice. I tried removing his... Okay. This guy's actually being a pain. It's time to bring out the sapper. Yeah. Die! I missed. Boom. <laughs> Did you see that lightning? Holy crap, that was awesome. Staff of Silence. That's so good against mages. Alright. Thank you, Sapper. You did well. Let's equip this freaking huge claymore now. Let's just go Rambo on some people. Before that, maybe we should actually heal up. Let's just drink a potion. Restoration takes forever to, like, train anyways. Hmm... Here we are in the courtyards. Getting closer. Where's the mage? I'm pretty set for just killing Fathis Aaron right now. Killed all his other friends. Oh, and he deserves it after placing all those locks. Okay. Gotta do this right. This flame atronach is in there with them. I do not approve of that. 30 feet. That's 60 feet, okay. Okay. Let's go back to finger. How did you see me? Fathis! It's my pleasure. Please continue. Um, hello? Not only has necromancy been banned from practice in the Mages Guild, but the guild won't deal with anyone who openly uses it. 
Interesting. Bye bye. I'm just gonna kill this. Hope you don't mind. So, um... You haven't, like, seen an arrow of extra something I could borrow? I'm just gonna... Put that... Soul gems... Okay. Is this guy supposed to be hostile, or is he just supposed to sniff his Guma? You know, Aaron... <laughs> you made a lot of pretty bad locks in here, so... Yeah! Die, you infidel. I just had to. Come on. Come on, guys. Come on. I'm gonna steal your stuff. Alright, a new uh, thingy. That's good. Oh my god, he's a member of the Mages Guild! Oh my god. That's why he wasn't hostile. <sighs> it's okay. I can get back into the guild. I can take an initiate reinitiation quest. Are you kidding me? That sucks so much. I should have I should have known. He was a mage. I wasn't really thinking straight. But okay. It's okay. Don't worry about it. We're we're going to be fine. <laughs> the mages are going to be a bit upset, but it's okay. He was a nobody. He was a nobody. We've done enough for the major skill. They'll forgive us. Besides those locks, that was just mean. But now that we have the arrowheads, we are one step closer to uh, completing the Grey Fox's great, great master plan. Foxy. I'm back. I got a gift for you. Good to hey. I've been waiting. Arrow. Do you have the arrow of extrication? Yes. I only have the arrow's head. Hmm. I'd hoped for the whole arrow. But that is not your fault. I will have to have it repaired. This arrowhead advances my plan to... Well, never mind. I may have need of you again in the near future if my plans hold. Here is your reward. I am also promoting you to Master Thief in the Thieves' Guild. Ooh. Fathis Ools of the Imperial City will be your new fence. Master Thief. Alright. Shadow That's right, we can always pay like, um... Seek my help. Ah, why haven't I thought about that before? Whenever I got into trouble, I can just find like a Thieves Guild member and like pay off my bounties for half the price. But oh well. We've done quite well for ourselves, gotten ourselves kicked out of a guild, but it's okay. We got 3000 gold, not bad. We got ourselves a new weapon called the Sapper. And things are just looking good. Well, my name is your voice from Dark. Thank you so much for watching. I'm still good. Yep, he's contacting me soon. But until that day comes. What brings you here? Your face. I'm still a good day taker and stay awesome. But most importantly, everybody, stay dark. Goodbye.